Hi guys and welcome back to Domi Starcraft, this is your host Domi with another Starcraft Remaster replay for you guys. Once again we have a great engagement in between the two pro players from the South Korean scene. So let me just start by introducing the players to you guys as we are spawning here in the upper left in the white. It is best, a very very strong uh, opponent here or Bisu as Bisu is spawning here in the lower left in the brown. So a nice PvP we have here, Protoss versus Protoss, I believe it is on Fighting Spirit here, a 4 spawning location map. So interesting, interesting stuff here in between two of the best protos in the period of 2016-2017, I believe this replay has been played. So yeah, both players are opening up here really standard with a pylon, same can be said here for best. And yeah, let's just see what exactly the difference or is there any difference going to be here in the build order in between these two pro players. What exactly do they have prepared for us? Still now very, very standard stuff here. Gateway followed up here for Bisu. Let's just quickly check. Indeed, there is the gateway, and there is the gateway here for uh, best. And already a small difference as best is sending out here his probe really, really quickly here out on the map. So nice, nice stuff here by for him. But sadly, he's heading straight into the wrong direction. So at one point, I was thinking that he would make it here in the lower left, but no, sadly for him, he's going into the upper right. And yeah, both players are of course mining 11 probes for each. There we have that gas. Gas is also a little bit quicker here for Bisu. If we check the timing, yes, a little bit of a difference here. So Bisu making sure that that gas is a little bit faster. Notice that he has also placed here a pylon into this way here. So perhaps this pylon is going to give a little bit of a boost here towards those probes. Another pylon is out here for Bisu, and Bisu sending out here his scout at a two minute mark. So, the difference here once again in between Bisu and Best, and at the same time, sadly, also Bisu sending out here his probe into the wrong direction. So, these two probes might meet here on the map. Let's just check here the base from Best. His first zealot is out. I believe Bisu also having here the first zealot, and we soon might see a first encounter here in between these two probes as they will very likely meet here so this might give Bisu an idea that best is in the upper right part here after the timing but he would be sadly wrong and now finally best is making here his way towards Bisu's base this should be of course the cybernetic score here for Bisu let's check the timing from the cybernetic score here for best so pretty much the same timer here as we have yet another pylon here being made by uh, Bisu and there is yet another pylon here being made by Best. So yeah, really, really similar build order here by the two pro players. Both also choosing here to opt for only one Zealot exit. There is that second Zealot here for uh, Best. And Bisu also having here the second Zealot. So yeah, we're slowly but steadily heading here towards the five minute mark. Let's just see if or are they going to do a expansion. And what exactly is this? It is the robot, robotics facility base, so we might see some abusement here by Best with some shuttles. Let's just check here Bisu, and there is also a building here, so this also might be here a robotics facility base. So nice, nice timing. You can check, of course, the time here in the lower left part, in case you are a Protoss player, just to see the build order here by these two players. So both, both players are heading here towards a robotics facility base, so we might see some Reaver gameplay, we might see some shuttle gameplay here by these two pro players. And yeah, let's just see exactly what the next steps are. Some pylons are being built now. And the same can be said here for Bisu, but Bisu already placing here this pylon into this proximity just to see exactly if there is a shuttle gameplay coming to go out. And we also have the first engagement here in between Bisu and Best. But Best already at two Dragoons here. The second Dragoon is out here for Bisu. And there is this one probe here, also giving good vision here for Bisu in case there is a army move out here. We also have another probe here checking perhaps the expansions here or best. So yeah, still a waiting game here. Let's just see what exactly will they be building here out of this robotics facility bay. And it's the first observer here for Bisu. Same can be said here for best. So pretty much the same build order here for both players. Playing very very safe here. The only uh, difference here, perhaps, let's just see. There is a robotic support bay. Nice pylon placement here by Bisu. And let's just see, does Best also have here this robotics facility bay support bay? Sorry. And there it is. Yes, indeed, nicely hidden here in the upper left part. 
And let's just check the timing once again. Be so a little bit faster here than best and there's the, also the first reaver so of course reaver is very very much important unit if you go protoss versus protoss here and we also see the first probe out so we might see an expansion probe has been sniped here and it looks like best also going here towards his expansion at the 5 minute and 30 second mark let's check bisu also so really 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 nicely sought through build orders here by these two pro players i guess in the end it will come of course towards the microing here in the battles just to see which one is going to be the victor best actually feeling very very confident here with only three dragoons he needs to be careful perhaps just wishes to snipe a pylon or two just deal some damage but he has of course to retreat and there is this observer from bisu spotting here everything so really really nice job here by bisu let's just check where is the observer here from best did i missed it i said i can't see it but it should be out on the map Perhaps it was sniped. Yeah, let's just see. The first reavers are also out here. So really, really nice gameplay here by both players. And now it's just a waiting game here. Both players are building their B lines here towards their expansions. No big engagement yet in between these two pro players. And let's just see some gateways are following up. I still don't see the observer here from best. This is a pylon, of course. But Bisu doing a really, really nice job here with his observer just moving here out through the map and also <coughs> sorry positioning here his observer really really nicely just to see exactly when that shuttle <coughs> shuttle is going to move out here by uh, best right now be so actually feeling really really confident we have made it to the seven minute mark here he's actually moving out here with his dragoons with his zealots and we also need to give have a nice eye here on this shuttle there is finally this observer here from best a little bit late and look at that in comes bisu with his shuttle with his reavers and the first probes might get targeted here great great sniping here by bisu so the first casualties have been done here even another probe is being sniped here the first blood goes indeed here towards bisu so this army move out was just a maneuver just to keep best at bay here into this position but in the end the real damage dealer was of course here this shuttle with that reaver so nice nice first snipe me here by bisu bisu also opting here to go for those um, upgrades here so speed upgrades you can also see the upgrades here in the upper left part guys in case i've missed it so yeah really nice job here by bisu with those first kills and look at that he's already at five more workers here up against best so nice nice job here by him nice nice placement out of those pylons he really wants to make sure that he sees the first move out with that shuttle but in the end he is the one being aggressive here with his shuttle with his reaver so really really nice job here by bisu retreating here now at his home also positioning here his dragoons really really nice in case there is a drop coming the same can be said now of best of course and also nice beeline here into this position so both players playing very very defensively only that uh in push here with this shuttle in the difference here by Bisu, I guess Bisu was trying to head into this position. It would have been a good, good drop, but there are of course Dragoons. And there's also this nicely placed pylon here, observing here and seeing everything. Also notice here the observers in the air, nicely positioned here by both players, just to defend their expansions. And we actually now see a army move out, but the same can be said here by Bisu. He sees this of course with his observer, so the observer micro also is very, very important here for both players as there is that move out here and where are those rivers one river is at home perhaps just to be defensive here is there a shuttle yes indeed there is a shuttle here for best so this was just another maneuver here perhaps just to snipe those probes but bisu being ready for that with his dragoons and yeah one pylon has been killed you can see it here in the upper left part but in the end best only did this of course to snipe those uh, probes and Pest is actually moving out. There should be an observer here as well. Or a beast. So now it's just a dragoon. The dragoon gets nicely sniped. And we also need to have an eye onto this shuttle with only one reaver. One reaver still at home. So best sadly for him. Not making anything, any kills here. As Bisu still has four extra probes here against his opponent. Now Bisu, interesting enough, is moving out here on the map. But he's just retreating really, really quick. And like I said, this shuttle is going to be very, very much important. But there are two dragoons here, so of course, best has to retreat. There's this forge being made for some upgrades, and just the observer 
checking here out any proximity we also have a templar archive so we might see some dark templar we might see some high templars weapons one upgrade is being done and once again let's just check what exactly the two players have prepared the shuttle is still there is it two reverse one reverse no it's actually zealots now well, hold on we have two shuttles now interesting stuff here by best taking a nice path here at the same time he's moving out here with his army but these two shuttles are very very important now they're finally being detected here by beast so beast already sniping here one shuttle but the second shuttle is really really important dropping here those reavers and the ropes will take so much damage but once again beast heading straight towards this one shuttle sniping here this shuttle and also killing here the reavers so sadly here for best it was a really really nice try but in the end those dragoons here in this upper part really dealing that good damage here towards the shuttles and the two shuttles have been sniped so have the reavers and now sadly here for best he just has to move back and the beast who knows that all of a sudden he has the advantage he has the more army supply here against his opponent and is this going to be the victory here for him let's just see beast who is moving out he's a little bit behind now of course the defenses look still strong here for best and B, so I don't know if he should commit here, but of course he knows much better than me. He's taking so much damage here out of those weavers in the back. And with this shuttle all, almost getting snapped. But the weavers will of course once again be the real damage dealer. And B, so of course waiting now here for his reinforcements to come in. There are those zealots who need to be in the front. B, so is retreating at the same time. He is expanding. The same can be said perhaps here by best into this position. And let's just see how things unfold. We actually have four high templars here for best. Of course, that splash damage with those psionic stone really, really strong. And here, Bisu almost losing this one river here. Same can be said here by best. And I believe he did lose one river. Yes, indeed, one river has been lost. Early. A better position here for best. But in the end, Bisu having more and more rivers here against his opponent. And we also see one Archon getting sniped. So Bisu all of a sudden, of course, he's using his advantage. There was even a Dark Templar here, but he gets immediately sniped. There is that Archon, the upper part here from the army from best has been sniped and now all of a sudden yes indeed beast looks really really strong he still has those two weavers and now sadly here for best he needs to fight for his life no more weavers are available for him in come the reinforcements he might snipe a weaver or two but there is still this one shuttle who can might throw them back and yes indeed best is going now for that shuttle he snipes the shuttle so the weavers are on the ground they need to fall back they need to be micro back beast is of course known for his nice micro good splash damage one river might get snapped but the second river is still alive here building those scarabs here with that splash damage so really really nice job here by these two zealots are in the front the even the archon and even a high temper is coming in and there is that high temper store and even another stone could have been casted here on those probes and of course this has to be the gg here for best best sadly losing here this game with a nice try here with this drop but sadly for him it didn't work out bisu in position with two dragoons here really nicely also notice the spread here from those pylons and sniping this first zealot shuttle and the second zealot uh, the second weaver shuttle sadly didn't make anything happen here or best so that was sad it was a very very good try and he, he could have caught bisu by surprise but he was prepared luckily here for him and with that advantage she just moved out and just finished here best so really really nice gameplay here by both players especially at the beginning of the game you could just see the build orders really really interesting and yeah let's just check those statistics in case you guys are interested also same apm here for both players once again i'm going to be clicking left and right for you guys so yeah great great pvp so if you're a protoss players and you fight another protoss players i believe this re uh, replay here could help you a lot i hope it helps you a lot so yeah once again guys i hope you enjoyed this replay we'll be seeing you of course in the next replay this is tommy signing out